With me today is Dr. Micah Christensen with Anthony's Fine Art. We think of Cecil B. DeMille as the director of the Ten Commandments, which may be the greatest biblical epic that was ever done in Hollywood history. The film that he did just before that was Samson and Delilah, which was a tremendous hit in its own right. He uh, prays that his strength will come back. I pray thee, strengthen me, O God. Strengthen me only this once. And with that strength, he pushes down the pillars, ending his enemies and himself. It's a high moment in drama. This man has the strength of a devil. No, the strength of a god. When Norman Rockwell made uh, a work, uh, he didn't often save the preparatory drawings. And sometimes he gave them away as gifts. And in this case, he gave this full-size monumental drawing to the actor Victor Mature who posed for the work. He sent it in a mail tube from a studio in Vermont to Victor Mature in Hollywood. And the reason we know this is because just a few years ago it was found after the passing of Victor Mature in his attic still in the mail tube unopened. When we opened it we knew that it was fragile. Norman Rockwell, when he was doing his large works, like many artists of his generation, did their final preparatory drawings, especially in monumental scale, on butcher paper. So when you look at this piece, it's uh, about two-thirds, one sheet of paper, and then from here over you see a little bit of a line that's another piece that has been cut, and there's a little that's been added on the bottom, which means that when we took it out of the tube, uh, it was taped together on the back with that old cellulose tape that just crumbles after a decade or so. We took it to a conservator so that it wouldn't smudge because it's got charcoal, which is very prone to that. Had it placed on linen and then placed behind a protective light filtering acrylic that keeps it from fading. So it, it's very fragile, or it was, and now it's very stable. 